loving, caring, just, you know, full of life, light up the room. And I have an update, an important one to that deadly shooting in Pompano Beach that claimed the lives of Delena James and Devon Johnson, both from Pompano Beach that were unfortunately gunned down at the Pals Convenience Store in Pompano Beach, a tragic Sunday, February the 26th, that many of us were shaken by, friends and family searching for answers. Well, a month later, the Broward Sheriff's Office has arrested 18-year-old Damien Westain Sharman. Devastation, leaving friends and family and the community of Pompano Beach in absolute shock and terror. Friend, um, we've been friends for a long time, so we came out here for, you know, emotional support. Damien Westane Charlemagne, he's only 18 years old and is already up to no good, and he would be identified as one of the shooters. He is currently in custody on unrelated charges, however, now he faces additional charges that include two counts of first degree murder and three counts of first degree attempted murder with a firearm. What took place that Sunday on February the 26th? Well, approximately around 9.01 p.m. The Broward Sheriff's Office responded to multiple calls on behalf of a shooting that took place at the Pals Liquor Store. As deputies arrived and Pompano Beach Fire Rescue, they located five people suffering from gunshot wounds. 35-year-old Damon Johnson, the adult male, and Delana James, the adult female, were pronounced dead at the hospital. Now remember this, this is just one of the killers that was arrested by the Broward Sheriff's Office this month, all right? There's many others out there that are on the loose, so if you know of anything, the sheriff says, contact the Broward Sheriff's Office. Don't be afraid. It's not snitching or writing out. What these guys did is not gangster at all. They killed innocent people. And if you want to remain safe and keep your community safer like we all love and preach, you need to turn them in. I'm sure somebody out there knows way more information than authorities. There's always somebody out there. As soon as I get more updates on behalf of this tragic killing, I'm sure I'll let you guys know. I'm the Reagan News Reporter, always doing my best to keep you guys updated and let you know if things are happening around you that you may not hear about. But I got you covered. Be safe. Be careful. Always be aware of your surroundings. It is very dangerous out here in Broward County. It's just a reality. I got to keep it real with you good people. Breaking News Reporter, here in Broward County. Action 55 News. What in the world is going on in Broward County, South Florida? Don't miss with the Breaking News Reporter. This all, Where are this? Not yet. All of this commotion happening right now.